Residents at a troubled care facility in Western Iowa are looking for a new home. It comes after Governor Reynolds announced Glenwood Resource Center will be closing for good. The institution has been the center of a federal investigation for years. It found failures on several fronts like unsupervised human experiments and the center won't close immediately. KCCI's Kayla James has the next step for residents and staff members making that transition. Kayla. Yeah, Ray, the center will shut down by summer 2024, but the transition is a two year process starting immediately. For the residents, for the families and for the employees and everyone in Glenwood, and even with a long lead time, it's still devastating news. Devastating news for about 150 residents and the 700 plus employees currently at Glenwood Resource Center. Starting Thursday, a two year process begins caring for residents all while helping their families and employees find new facilities focused on intellectual and developmental disabilities. As state lawmakers, we have a deep responsibility to ensure that this transition goes as smoothly and safely as possible. The plan is to get residents into Woodward Resource Center or other community facilities. Retention incentives like a $1,500 lump sum payment every seven pay periods are offered for employees who remain. And as the summer 2024 closure date approaches, the state plans to help staff find new jobs in their career. In a statement, House Speaker Pat Grassley acknowledged the process ahead, saying in part, we will also be working closely with state agencies and local officials to ensure we support the needs of the community throughout this process. Governor Reynolds in her statement noted closing Glenwood was a hard decision, but a necessary one to better care standards and reinvest in the future. By June of 2023, the hope is to have half of current residents out of Glenwood and into Woodward and other facilities. The last half to be moved by June of 2024. June 30th of that year is when the center will close. Rhea. Thank you, Kayla. Well, problems with Glenwood Resource Center can be tracked back to 2002. The DOJ concluded that conditions then were constitutionally deficient. In 2007, Iowa received a grant to improve services at the institution, but despite efforts, the same problems remained. In 2019, the Justice Department launched a probe into sexual arousal experiments. Glenwood's medical director later resigned.